powered on. The home screen is automatically displayed, featuring the function area in the top left corner. At the bottom of the screen, it displays the log upload and device management menus, aircraft connection status, and the button for entering operation view from left to right. On the user info screen, you can view the personal information and permissions of the logged in user, including the user's task area, flight hours, and total flights. Under My Agris team, you can preview the team to which the current account belongs or switch teams. Fields are bound to teams. Please keep this in mind when switching teams. The owner account can create and manage teams. Fields are bound to teams and will change when teams are switched. It is recommended to enable flight record auto sync to allow the remote controller to promptly synchronize task details to the DJI Agriculture server for easy management and review. On the flight record screen, you can upload flight records to synchronize task details to the DJI Agriculture server for easy management and review. The exit button allows you to log out of the current account. After logging out, you can scan the QR code or enter your account to log in again. Click to enter Message Center, where you can view unread and historical messages. Click to enter General Settings, where you can set the measurement unit and other parameters based on your requirements. Click Language and select System Default. Multi-language audio files are available and will be automatically downloaded when you switch the remote controller language. For privacy settings, it is recommended to enable all the options for convenient task management. We recommend opting to become a super contributor of the DJI Product Improvement Project, as this helps us refine algorithm models, improve flight safety, and optimize operation experience. On the storage management screen, you can clear different types of data from the app. When the remote controller memory is insufficient, general data may be cleared, while important data must be preserved. Network diagnosis allows you to check whether the remote controller is connected to the network properly. A successful connection will be indicated by green lines connecting the corresponding nodes. Beginner guide will be displayed when you go to operation view using the remote controller for the first time, enabling you to understand the function of each icon by pressing and holding the icon. If you expect the beginner guide to display in future usage, you can click Reset. Click Document Management, and you can view Task, Tasks in Progress, Task Templates, Materials, Reconstruction Output, and Prescription Map. The data may be stored locally on the remote controller, the cloud of the DJI Agriculture Server, or a microSD card. After inserting a microSD card, in addition to accessing data stored in it, you can import plot and prescription map from the microSD card. On the task screen, planned field is collected. You can sort fields by time and distance or categorize them by field type. With the search function, you can quickly find the desired fields in the database. You can click a field to rename it, upload it to the cloud, or delete it. Multiple fields can be selected for deletion or upload at a time. In addition, you can download fields from the cloud. Task in Progress collects tasks that were partially completed. You can retrieve and resume the task or simply click Finish to mark it as completed. In Task Template, spreading or spraying task parameters are preset. You can click the template to view and directly use the settings in a flight task. Also, you can upload the template to the cloud. Material templates save the application information of different material for spreading. Relationship curve between the flow rate and the gate size of the opening based on the type of material being spread could be generated after calibration. Reconstruction output is the results generated after the mapping of fields or fruit trees, which can be used for field planning or editing 3D flight paths. Prescription map is the variable rate application tasks that are generated after processing the multispectral drone images. When an agricultural drone malfunctions and requires data analysis, you can click Log Upload, select the issue, find the logs or flight records generated at the time of the malfunction, and click Upload. After uploading is complete, a QR code will be generated. 
Take a photo of it. Describe the issue you encountered and send the photo to a DJI agriculture dealer or the DJI after sales email address for analysis. On the device management screen, you can view the firmware versions of the connected devices. If a later version is available, you can update the firmware to experience the latest features. Here, you can also activate or check the status of the DRTK mobile station, charging devices, and DJI Relay. After connecting to a DJI generator through the USB-C cable, you can click charging device to view information such as the altitude and activation time.